All right, this is just a quick video on the Reed VK3, CK1, CK2. This is a main valve key. Um, if you guys are using a small key for a stubborn main water valve, it won't uh, that, and it doesn't work. This this might be the tool that you might be needing. Um, I ran into a problem where I couldn't turn off the water. Had to call a plumber, and this is the actual tool that he he used. Um, so basically, it comes with three keys. I have no idea what this box for. I'm probably never gonna use it. It's made out of like heavy duty steel. Uh, this is the main key that we usually use and the one that I needed I think was this two inch uh, key so basically this thing comes apart let me see if you can see it from there so this thing comes apart and uh, it has pins take it apart and this thing is very heavy gauge steel and this is actually what you're gonna use to to turn. Hoping to not need this anytime soon. But basically, these parts come apart. They're hooked up with pins. And the height is adjustable. show you guys not a lot of videos on this tool so I thought I'd make a video so this one is on the highest setting and then this part would go over here you would stick the pin right there and basically let's, let's do the pin so I can Yeah, the plumber, the plumber came by and uh, showed me the tool and basically that's how tall the tool is. I am 5'10 and this is how tall the tool is and basically you could uh, exert a lot of force in turning on and turning off the, the valve the main valve so basically you have two options you can either have it this tall or you can adjust it to the to a lower setting or a lower height which drops it down to about right here the guy who showed me this tool was a little bit short and it looked a little bit awkward so Again, I'm 5'10", not the tallest guy in the world, but not the shortest guy either. And uh, this one goes about up to my chest. And uh, I think with this one, you could turn the meter key or the, yeah, the, the valve key with this one a lot easier. Um, again, it comes with three attachments, $199 on Amazon. It's like 215, 217 with tax. Um, but it actually will save a lot of money by not having to call a plumber every time you need to turn off the water in a commercial building. And when you take it apart, everything comes apart like that. And everything has a little slot for it so that it's not really taking up a whole lot of space when you're storing it. Because this is probably one of those tools that you're not going to use every day. So with that like that, take this piece. And everything has these pins that are really, really cool. This is how big it is. That's, that's how much you're going to have to store. I mean, for a tool like this, you're shutting off water all the time uh, whether you're a professional or not I got the idea from a 
professional. So I like to have nice things and to be able to do things that I can't do when I really need to do it. This thing is going to be very, very, very handy. Very, very, very important. Definitely worth $215, $217. I'm going to put an Amazon link on this video. And uh, that's basically what the guy showed me. And uh, I don't know how many of you guys who are watching this video has ran into that problem. And uh, for me, this is the solution. Uh, this is the Reed VK3, CK1, and uh, CK2. This is a main valve key, one inch curb key, two inch curb key. That's made by Reed.